Let's see if we can get Steve on. Steve, welcome to the show. Hi, how are you doing? Right, Steve, yeah, man. good, Steve. Steve, what do you want to say, mate? Um, so just listening to all the other callers, really. I mean, I think the biggest problem. I think the biggest problem is everyone keeps talking about Sterling. Now, if Sterling's a winger that's going to hit hit the byline and get balls into Kane, that's fine. If he's going to be greedy, it's got to be more clinical. Because, you know, 30-odd shots on target, we're not going to get that against Belgium, against Spain, against Italy. And I think, you know, the problem with rely, we're relying on Kane. Kane to do everything. If Kane doesn't score, we don't score. And I think, you know, it comes a point where, you know, he plays for a big team, he plays for Man City. But, you know, it is, it's a difficult one with Sterling because he's such a class player. But if he's not going to score goals like you need him to then for me he doesn't play he doesn't play in any championships Oof, that's big um i agree with everything that you're saying there because he is a class player and he he offers so much to the team doesn't he so much but he isn't a, a winger because th- those days of the old school wingers of the 442 they they're, they're no longer here are they he's a player in that front three and therefore part of his gig as well as obviously creating is putting the ball in the back of the net, and he so, needs three, so, four chances. The to thing do that. is, Steve. The thing is, Steve. That we, we've. I think it's fair to say that, that it's not the strongest suit in f- scoring in front of goals, but there aren't many players that can get into those areas the way that he does. Agree. He he is. He has. He get. I mean, he gets into spaces because he's of his pace, and there aren't many that have got that pace under their bonnet that that, that can do that. Yes, I admit there are times in, in games that his finishing could be better. But he, he scored his 150th goal of his career today. So, you know, he's, he's doing something right. I wonder whether we're expecting a bit too much from him. I wonder whether we're... He's not a Harry Kane. Very few people are. That's not his strong suit. What is he good at? He's good at certainly getting into spaces. He's incredibly quick. He travels with the ball well. His link-up play is excellent. I th- why, why, why are we looking at... What he can't do so well. Why don't we look it's, at it's what? A bit, it, it's why a can't big we, thing. It's a big we, thing, Jay. Putting we, the ball in the net is a big thing. Yeah, that's, what, that's what he's there for. Yeah, but you don't take for me for my money. What he brings to the team is is huge, and you do not take him out the team because his finishing is not the best. That's how I. He's not on, for me. His number one job in that team is not to score goals. It, yes, it's his job, but not number one. His number one is to is to is to assist the, during the World all right, Cup. All right, then. that position that he plays, then that position yeah. that he plays. Sorry, Steve, we're, we're hogging your line yeah, right yeah. here. <laughs> yeah. That position that he plays. Would you play Jack Grealish instead of him? Um, I think that that Jack adds a huge amount to the team. But if you're looking for goals, you don't go to Jack Grealish. Jack Grealish's goal scoring record in the Premier League is. Is, no, he plays a different position. He no, plays a different saying, position in the saying, Premier League, doesn't he? No, but what I'm saying is Jack Jack has a, a huge amount of ability. But one thing you don't look at, Jack, is to score a lot of goals. Now, that may come in his career. He may find a way. that you know He, he is the go-to guy at Villa. If he played at, in Man City, Jack Grealish, his goal-scoring record, tally, would be far higher, I'm guessing, than it is right now. But I, I, sometimes we look at players about what they can't do. Look at what Sterling can do. Look at what Sterling does bring. Look at what's, Because during the World Cup, right, the way that the system that we played, he, he played more centrally than he does for Man City. And I thought we had a really good tournament. And a lot of people look back at that tournament because of his, he missed a lot of chances, and he did. And he did miss a few chances that he should have scored. But what he brought to that team during that tournament for me, outweighed that. I think that his his, his ability to, to play in behind Kane and disrupt defences with his pace, they give us an extra five or six yards, I felt helped the team more than people recognised. 